Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back. We're Steph here and we're playing some idle arena today. It's a big day today, guys. The global launch just happened. I started over on a new global server here. I am on a server. Let's take a look here. What server I'm on? Change servers. All right, so if you're playing the game right now, do not enter the early access server, guys. Those servers are the beta servers. Try to enter one of these official launch servers. And let's see, the one that I settled in was server 8. So I am on server 8 right now. And now we're going to get into some summonings, guys. I got a little bit lucky here with some pulls already here. Uh, there's a tier list. I'll post it back up here if you are curious about what the tier list is looking like for early level uh, gameplay. Uh, this guy right here, I'm very happy about Sharkovsky. So I'm, I'm glad I got a copy of Sharkovsky here. The rest, I'm not too happy about. Grim, I'm not liking right now. He's just squishy as all hell and he's not doing that much damage. So we're going to get into it right now. We're going to go into the recruitment center. And by the way, guys, here is my alliance. So take a look. Come join the alliance. F is for family. We got two people up in here right now. We just started. Brand new alliance. This should be a lot of fun here. So uh, first off, recommendations, guys. Here, the new hero that has dropped into the game is Artemidy. New hero revealed. There is a 200% recruitment chance. So I'm kind of confused why the 200% recruitment chance. Does that mean that we have a really good chance of pulling her twice in one summon? I'm not sure what that means, but she is an incredible hero, guys. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to use the 4,000 gems right here. The first thing I want to do is get Artemidy here. So, let I ah, Only one. All right, so you're guaranteed Artemidy here. So, that's great. And we got some Walter. Nothing great other than that. So, we'll take that. We're down to 11k gems here. So, now we're going to do the recruit all types of heroes. And this is where the luck comes into play guys so here it is guys wish me some luck here we are looking for a couple of different heroes here caesar another sharkovsky um artemidy i'll take any one of those please oh huge disappointment right here no nothing i was looking for at all second ten pull here come on baby wow back to back nothing all right third all right there's a purple Come on, an elite right here. Give me something good. Konku. Oh my god, that is pathetic. I totally do not need him whatsoever, guys. Last one. Hero stash is full. So we got to get rid of some characters here. So let me show you what happens here when you get the recruit all here. We get one of these red boxes. So let's take a look at what the box is all about. There we go. And select any character that you want in the game, guys. Literally every character in the game you can select. Well, the, the, the elite heroes here. So this is a tough choice for me here because I didn't get lucky in my pulls whatsoever, man. Some terrible luck. Do I want to take my Sharkovsky to the next level? Do I want to unlock a Caesar? Do I want to, want to get Captain Meowstic here? Jeez, uh, there's so many choices. But we do have one more pull here. So before we do that, let's go into the lab. And uh, let's make a couple of different copies here. So let's just do that. Boom. Elite Plus. And at this point now, I just auto everything. Make it a lot easier for myself. This is all we got from there. And uh, boom. All these characters are going to be fodder for me. So I might as well just go this way and this way. I'm just going to use these as sacrifices later on in the game. So for now, it doesn't really matter. Mm, let's use you. Okay, boom. Next one, boom, boom. So we're getting a good amount of material here to sacrifice for the future. All right, let's head back into the summoning. Last summoning here, guys. Please give me something I need. There it is. Come on, come on, come on. Give it to me. Automatic, yes. All right, that is great. Woo. Fantastic pull right there, guys. That's what you're looking for right there. Check it out. We got two copies of Artemidy here. So let's go into the lab of evolution. Now check it out. Bang, bing, bong. Ready to fuse. Yes, I am. Artemidy goes from elite to elite plus. So, and then once you're at elite plus, you need two more elite plus characters in order to uh, get her to the next tier. So we're just going to keep getting some more fodder here. Right, that's good. Uh, let's do these guys here now. Godfrey. Godfrey. And. Uh, last one. Bam. Another elite. 
All right, so let's take a look at the squad. How are we looking here? So first of all, now that we've got this for our Artemidi here, we have no choice. I basically have to go with the last remnants here because uh, obviously she's a great, great character. And I'm kind of trying to see what... Mm, I'm trying to develop a good little squad here, but it's going to be a little weird because I'm looking at three different factions. Typically, you don't want to do that. You want to stick to two factions... Three in one faction, two in another faction, or four in one faction. It's going to be a little bit tough. I kind of wanted... Damn, I wanted the Lost Faith faction, to be honest, in this count here. Or the Quiet Storm. Mm, this really puts a damper in my plans here. I'm not going to lie. Wow, let's take a look here at what I need to evolve Armity one more time here. So yeah, two more of any last remnant elite pluses. So we've got one, but she's locked. She's not last remnant. That's right, guys. We need one more last remnant in order to evolve her. So we can't do her. Let's see what we're looking at. Quiet Storm here. I do have one elite. So, um, hmm. Sharkovsky. Yikes. Decision, decision, guys. This is where the decision comes into play. I'm not sure what I want to do with this. I'm not, not sure. If I can get another Artemidi here and I can get her to the next level, that last copy is going to really be very very good for me but also ooh, let's see i want to get another quiet storm hero here let me take a look at the gallery and let's see which direction i'm gonna go with oh, let's look at sheer sheer is an incredible character here guys sheer infuses his gigantic sword with plasma energy his normal attack now deals damage in a cone-shaped aoe uh ignoring all the defense for five seconds all damage causing by sheer during this duration will then restore health divided equally to all his quiet storm allies wow that is tremendous guys i love that ability by sheer they're so you know what i think my plan is going to be all right, I got it. The plan is going to be go quiet, three quiet storm, or maybe four quiet storm, to be honest, and then just go with Artemid here for the last member. Huh, that's the early game plan for now, guys. So, yep, let's go ahead. Let's do it. I hope I'm not making a, a wrong decision here. And before I even do that, oh man, there's so many doubt. I want to take a look at uh, Captain Meowstastic here because I uh, might need him as well. Uh, uses his magical fish wand to quickly recover all of his allies' health. 1.25 of their max HP every 25 seconds, lasting for 5 seconds. 25.25 seconds for last second. So, healing there. When a battle begins, Kevin will immediately target an ally with the lowest damage rating and follow this ally with the. Wowzers Bowsers! Creates a protective shield. Sphere around his position, shielding all allies standing. Wow, this is he's very he's an awesome support character, guys. Wow, he's an incredible support character. So the question is whether I should go with Sheer or Captain Meowstake. And you know what? Sheer is just too cool to pass up. I cannot pass up on Sheer, guys. I did it. We went with Sheer. So uh, the team is starting to shape up here. Let's go ahead and uh, give him some gear here. Let's go ahead and level him up as much as I can. Let's unlock the next ability here. Ooh, my God. So many decisions going on here. Uh, I kind of wish that I was a little bit better with my pulls. But I'm not going to hate. I'm... The team is shaping up pretty good here. So let's go ahead and take a look what they're going to look like in a campaign battle here. So let's go ahead and take Grim out. Let's put Sheer in. Let's take out... Hmm, I need Artemidi for sure. Let's put her here. Hmm. We're not going to have a great... We're, we, right now, we don't have any team bonuses whatsoever. Because of the way it's faced. Even if I put him there, there's no team bonus. Only if we put him, we have a team... And I take her out. Yikes! This is not looking great, guys. So, at this point, it's still very, very early in the game. So, I don't think team bonus is that important for now. Especially for campaign. So we're going to go ahead and do it like this, but man, I'm going to have to really, really bucker down here and f figure out how I'm going to get these balanced out teams to get that little team bonus that we need to, to do better in arena and everything else. So we'll see how it turns out here. But for now, that's going to be pretty much it for today, guys. I just wanted to show you guys the progress of the squad and uh, how we're looking 
uh, moving forward here. So uh, that's it, guys. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Thanks a lot. Hope you guys are enjoying Idol Arena here and uh, look forward to playing with you in the future. All right, guys. Bye now. Thank <laughs> you.